hi to everyone and hi to all my followers on my youtube and also on an academy in this video we are going to discuss the very important relations between ka and kb pk and pkb okay they are very very important and the from this relations you can solve many problems on these concepts and uh, you can get the questions frequently in your competitive examinations and in your academic exam academic examination so that's why they are very important so watch the video completely and get the important relations here okay and don't forget to follow me on an academy and by searching chiranjeevi paramala and you can get the more standard chemistry concept lectures on iit chemistry so now i am dealing with uh, iit je mains targeting uh, 2019 so follow there and get more and more concept videos with uh, uh, previous year solved problems already 2014 and 2016 papers are completely solved with their uh, related concepts okay and you can get the multiple choice questions uh, on my profile and just uh, they are very standard just try to give the answers and get answers and uh, ask me uh, there in an academy and i give you okay right here now we can discuss the relations between k and kb pk and pkb okay right first thing what is k simply it indicates or it denotes the acid dissociation okay so simply here k is acid dissociation constant and it is directly proportional to h plus ion concentration or h3o plus ion concentration okay we can show h plus and h3o h3o plus ion concentrations equal some other right h plus ion concentration some others right or h3o plus ion concentration but uh, in reality we should write h3o plus ion concentration okay right now just observe ka here i have given upward arrow that means whenever increasing the value of ka simply that indicates increasing in acidic strength of the particular acid okay right now just observe kb what is kb base dissociation constant and it directly proportional to oh minus ion concentration okay right just observe here i have given upward arrow for kb that means whenever increasing the values of uh, base dissociation constant kb it simply resembles increasing the basic strength of that particular given base okay right now just observe here ka into kb equals to kw that is what is kw equilibrium constant of water in the previous lectures we have seen that means on an academy profile we have seen the um, equilibrium constant of water and there you seen that the product of concentrations of h plus ion concentration and oh minus ion concentration equals to kw that equals to 1 into 10 power minus 1 4 at 25 degree centigrade okay right and here we have shown ka is directly proportional to h plus ion concentration kb is directly proportional to oh minus ion concentration hence we can write ka into kb is equal to kw okay for example in the problem if we have given with ka and if we want to find kb then we can use the relation kb equals to kw by ka okay so like that we can find any kind of uh, uh, we can solve any kind of problem on this relation okay right now just check pka okay so just observe for pka i have given the arrow that is downward arrow that means the decreasing in pka values it simply in, uh, indicates the increase in acidic strength of acid okay so just listen carefully here so whenever pka value decreases acidic strength increases okay of the particular acid now just to check the relation between ka and pka here ka and pka have inversely proportionality relation that means whenever pka increases peak uh, sorry whenever ka increases pka decreases and both of them simply resembles increase in acidic strength okay so once again whenever pka decreases acidic strength of acid increases whenever ka increases acidic strength of acid 
increases okay so just remember that now just check pkb now i have shown downward arrow that means uh, whenever pkb value decreases it simply indicates increase in basic strength of the particular given base okay right now just check the relation between kb and pkb simply it is inversely rela inversely proportionality relation that means uh, whenever kb increases pkb uh, decreases okay right that means uh, uh, decreasing values of pkb indicates increasing strength of bases and increasing values of kb indicates increasing in basic strengths okay just remember all these relations carefully right now just observe here i have, I have given another relation that is pka plus pkb equals to pkw then that is equal 14 and just remember here pk have pk is equal to minus log ka and pkb is equal to minus log kw just recall we have ph is ph plus poh is equal to 14 here we have pka plus pkb that means uh, they also equals to 14 and that equals to pkw okay right by using these relations we can solve many problems okay just remember this chart okay right just observe some important points of it uh, very strong acids have pka values less than one and moderate strong acids have pka values between one to five and weak acids have pka values 5 to 14 okay by just remembering this chart you can solve the problems on relations with ka kb pka and pkb okay right and hope it is very helpful to you so that's why like my videos and subscribe my videos uh, that means my youtube channel chem master and don't forget to follow me on an academy there you can get more standard concept lectures with multiple choice questions okay it is very helpful to you and i'm targeting J means to the 19. So it is very helpful for you. Thank you.